are continuing with the little mini series how to get a curvy waist and today is part two so here is today's schedule and let's get into breaking down each of these moves all right so for the first move we're going to do swivel the ups and i like to incorporate weights whenever possible um these are eight pounds they might be a little too heavy aim for three pounds five pounds um, but you're gonna set up in a V-up position with your knees bent, feet flat on the floor, and you're gonna have your palms facing up, and you're just going to rock from side to side, and you're really using your core to turn your torso. You're not using your hips, you're not using your shoulders, you're just activating the ab muscles to really put in that work. So even if you don't want to hold weight, see, you can just go, so you can just go easily from side to side just by sticking your hands out. And it doesn't look like I'm doing much, but trust me, it hurts. So then when you use weights, just takes it to the next level. You're going to pretend like you're trying to tap your heels, but you're not going to be able to reach them. And I love, love that move. And you're going to, two. All right, for our next move, you're gonna to wanna to lay on your side. In my case, I'm on my right side. I'm bending my elbow, straightening out this leg. The other leg is bent behind this leg. And I'm going to lift off the ground. And I'm going to touch this elbow to my straight leg to the knee, elbow to knee. Sorry if I suck at instructions, guys. You, you can clearly see what I'm doing though. <laughs> and you wanna imagine that the upper torso, you're trying to get this bone to touch down here. It's not going to. That's how you want to envision. And again, another awesome move that I know you're going to love. And so this angle is always hard to film um, for YouTube when I am trying to show my full body, but you'll be able to get the general idea of it. I'm trying to go as far back as I can. For the wood choppers, you get a fairly heavy um, weight. This is 15, I could probably do 20. Um, you don't want to hurt yourself, but you just take it over across the face, so cross, so cross, and just chop it down, and when you chop it down, this knee is bending inward, so again, cross over, chop it down, to the side, so chop it down, and it's going past my knee. So chop and chop. And the whole time when it's coming up, that belly. This is literally the worst angle. <laughs> but every time I bring it up, my core is engaged. That belly button is going in. I'm keeping a nice tight contraction and chopping it down. Back up. Chop it down. Again. Clearly, I was on it to look cute on video. But I'll do anything for you. And by the way, I do use filters for my YouTube channel. I just want y'all to know um, because homegirl has the blackest, biggest bags under her eyes. You guys don't want to work out with somebody that looks like Chupitos. And if you don't know who Chupitos is, please Google it. Because <laughs> I guarantee I can't motivate you when I look like that. So, and I have so much I still need to do. I want to get my nails done again. I want to get my lashes done again. I want to get my eyebrows microbladed. These are just things that make me feel good. I'm not saying you have to go out and do that. But because um, we want to look at somebody that looks cute, right? So I'm just explaining why I use a filter. I'm not trying to scare you guys away. Anyways, look up Chupitos. And if you know who that is, please comment below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
I appreciate you guys. And I just want you to know that I appreciate you more than you'll ever know for hyping me up, for giving me my wings, um, for giving me this platform along with TikTok, Instagram, Pinterest, all of the above. I really appreciate you all trusting me. Like that's just, I still can't even wrap my head around it. So thank you again. I am nearing, um, I believe I'm at 135 thousand on tiktok already and i it's been crazy to see and i just want to appreciate you all because i know you're all coming from there um so thank you again for watching and i'll be back with part three